your neighbor as yourself. So that's what I want to do. I want to love him and I want to forgive him. Forgive him after surveillance video shows the thief steal two leaf blowers out of the garage. In case he comes back, the victim left him something special. And according to social media chatter, this may not be the only house this burglar hit. I'm John Holt. I'm Lauren Halifax. Fox Force Russell Coburn's back from Independence. Russell, what did she leave for this thief in case he does return? She left him a Bible. Now, officers are looking for the man, but she says she just wants the equipment back and hopes he turns his life around. It's the middle of the day Sunday. A dark SUV pulls up to the Collier's Independence home. A man runs up the driveway and into the garage, then emerges with two leaf blowers before driving off. No more than the car drove off, my husband came right back around to the side of the house. Jennifer Collier says her family was working in the backyard at the time, just 20 or so feet away. She believes since a neighbor's camera captured the SUV sitting in front of their house, the man waited until the coast was clear to strike. Do you kind of think, why a leaf blower? That was my first thought. There's so much more he could have taken that was far more valuable. Like her purse, she says, was sitting right there. Collier shared the video on social media, and someone told her about this Friday post from another neighborhood group. The person writes a man stole a leaf blower from an open garage, but appears to have been picked up in a different vehicle. We are disciples, and so we want to um, show him what that looks like. Instead of frustration, the Colliers turn to faith. Collier has left this Bible on her porch. She says her perfect situation would be the man comes back, leaves the leaf blowers, and takes the Bible. She's left it in this Ziploc bag to preserve it from the elements. It's right here, waiting for him. This particular edition says, live God's word every day. For Collier, that means mercy, even on the day, especially on the day you're the victim of a crime. Come on in, let's talk. We're not, we're not gonna call the police. The Bible's not gonna go anywhere. Well, police haven't said if those cases could be connected. The Colliers won't press charges anyway if the equipment is returned. Lauren?